Hello everyone, this is Parkour Potato, and today I'm going to be showing the 1970 Ford Galaxy model car I've put together. Uh, this is based from the movie Diamonds Are Forever. Um, with some research, uh, I looked it up. This car is actually in the movie. They're Ford Customs, but for whatever reason, on the box that they're selling it from, it's a Galaxy. So, I mean, same exact car, pretty much. But, um, I was also, uh, pretty shocked to see they had this at all, especially inside a store, because this is by no means a popular car, by any means, even for back in the day. And this, I just walked into Hobby Lobby to get a model car, because I wanted to try something new, and I saw this, and I just grabbed it, like, like that. And I, I knew I was getting it the second I saw it. I was like, there's no way I can see this and not buy it. So I bought it. Uh, it took me about 12 hours to build and paint and all that. Um, I've more, I mostly worked on it at nighttime. And I just kind of lost track of time. So I really don't know how long it took me. Uh, the interior is actually... It's really realistic. I mean, the dash and the, the gauge cluster, like the gauge cluster is just straight up a sticker that you have to get water on before you can put it on. But there's like a shotgun in there, a uh, radio. There was some more, but the instructions were unclear. So I just kind of did my own thing. Um, and there's only like one box in there with a, uh, with a mic. You can see the chrome. That's the uh, microphone and the shotgun holster. Not holster, but the holder for the shotgun. The shackle, I guess. Um, this started out this ugly blue and uh, it was really, really ugly, like plastic matte blue. And so I painted it and it doesn't look that great in some spots. It's kind of clumpy. looks like you got the landlord special. Uh, it's not perfect. I didn't have tape or anything like that, but I think it looks pretty good for my first model car. If you're wondering what the landlord special is, if you have an apartment and you go under the windowsill and you look at the paint and you see it's all clumped together and unprepped and just, you know, lazy. That's the landlord special. Also, I'm not a lazy bastard. This, they're, they're big boxes, okay? I can't just throw them in the trash. So, this comes equipped with the uh, 429 Boss engine. Um, of course, you glue all the pieces together. They come in separate pieces. Hi, Parmy. Radiator, you can still see the blue on the radiator. You can still see some blue right there on the cowl. You can see some white spots. It's not perfect, but I'm really satisfied with how, with how this came out. Um, whatever, that's not going on. The only thing that bothers me a lot, a lot, a lot about this model is the wheels. The tires do not stay on by any means. And so you literally just nudge it and it comes off. Uh, the, I really like it uh, down here. The uh, it's, It actually connects to a, quote, drive shaft. Um, you actually connect the exhaust to, you know, an, an actual piece that I can't really see it, but... I'm not even gonna try and remember the word for this part because I'm gonna get bullied if I get it wrong. Uh, exhaust manifold? I don't know. Uh, squeaky squeaky, you know. Yeah, this entire car came in blue and painted every piece, you know, except the chrome, of course. I can't just paint chrome. If I could, that'd be cool, but you know. Um. Yeah, I was, I'm really glad with how this came out, and 
just wanted to show it off. The bent the antenna to make it look like it has actually been worn, you know, from speed. It's really cool though because um, it's literally my car. It, it, this is my car down to the pieces. I mean, of obviously the wheels are not the same. Mine has Krager SS's with some big ass tires, but it's a four door. It's the same year. Obviously not the same engine. If I had the 429 Boss, that'd be cool. But you know, I only got a 351 Windsor. It's just really, really cool because I never would have expected I'd find a specifically a 1970 Ford Galaxy in a in a model car place. Uh, I've seen this online actually, but you know, I thought it was something that already existed a while ago. I didn't know this was new and currently being produced. But yeah. This is the 70 Galaxy model car from Diamonds Are Forever. And if I make more model cars, I will probably upload them on here because uh, I found out I like them. I mean, it's satisfying. I mean, look at this. This went from a blue heap of plastic to black and white American police car. And I was just fixing the tires on that as I close out the video. And I'm just really satisfied with this. I mean, it looks really clean. And there's a lot of pieces. I feel it just, I just feel like it really stands out. Anyway, guys, uh, thank you for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Leave a comment. Leave a, uh, tell me what you think. Leave a dislike if you feel the need to dislike a video about someone's model car. I really don't know why you would, unless you just hate my voice. Anyway, guys, um, thank you for watching, and uh, come back. Uh, I'll have some PlayStation 2 videos up soon. You should watch my uh, Grand Theft Auto 3 video. Yes.